Hi, this is Gary Fong, and one of the problems that people have uh, reported most to me was that when they're doing flash interior like this, it always looks so fake. And so what I've done is we're inside a very, very heavily tungsten lit environment, incandescent lighting, and so it's going to be very warm. If I take an available light photo with auto white balance, it'll look very warm. And it also, because we're in such low light, we're going to have a little bit of problem with uh, blurriness or motion or whatever. And then if you crank up the ISO a lot, then you're going to have some, some pretty uh, specular, kind of specky images. So. Then what people do is they put the camera on flash, direct flash. But what happens with direct flash is obviously it has that deer in the headlights look, but it's also a different color temperature because flash comes out very daylight looking. So you've got daylight looking uh, light on the person and then warm background. It just looks like flash. So what we want to do is we want to bring that difference between the front and the rear closer together. And the way we do that is shooting with the Amber Dome. The Amber Dome will take the light and warm it up within the bowl. Let me see if you guys can see that. So this is what it looks like. You see, I don't know if you can see, but the color of the bowl changes. When I take this off, you'll see that the color of the bowl is much wider. And so what it does is it actually just changes the color of the bowl. And changing the color of the bowl will bring the light to the subject much warmer, which then matches with this very warm light that we're bathed in right now, and it makes the flash look a lot less visible. So let me do a demonstration for you, and, uh, and you'll see how it works. Okay, so let's do the first one with just available light, no flash. Okay, and that's what that looks like. Now I'm going to turn the flash on, and this is just direct flash. So we'll just do this. And that's what you get with direct flash. And now I'm going to throw on the Amber Dome. So what the Amber Dome is going to do is it's going to bring in the difference between the front and the rear so it doesn't look so much like there's a harsh flash in the front. And there you go. Okay.